Welcome to the channel guys. Today we're going to go in great detail and talk about how we can actually use eBay for dropshipping and integrate it with CJ dropshipping. Now one of the major things that you need to understand whenever you're on eBay or thinking about selling on eBay is the mechanism of how to do it. There are certain elements that you have to keep in mind before you get into drop shipping on ebay because ebay is not a typical platform such as aliexpress or any other element it has a lot of different integrations that are required there's a lot of elements and policies that need to be kept in mind to ensure that you have the right possible methodology in place and the correct strategy to be used and obviously it's for that reason we're making these videos to give you a complete breakdown of what needs to be done and how it needs to be done and once we combine all those elements to together we're able to successfully start drop shipping so the first thing we're going to do is search for a product for example if you search for phone cases and obviously hit this button on search over here you'll see all the different searches that are going to come up for phone cases there's 780,000 results for phone cases now one of the major things and a mistake which a lot of individuals tend to make on ebay is the fact that they look for sponsored ads these are sponsored products that are being pushed through ebay to the top you don't want to go for this particular product you want to find the best possible product and obviously at the best possible price that is available as you scroll down and obviously there's two elements that you have to keep in mind the first one obviously is the price the second is the fact that where it's been shipped from for example this product is being shipped from china for two dollars and 98 cents if you scroll up you'll see that this product is being shipped from the uk for three dollars and 65 cents 117 have been sold by this you'll be able to see and understand exactly what product is coming from where and how much the shipping is going to cost you and how much the product is going to cost you now one of the major things you have to keep in mind guys is the fact that if you're thinking of doing drop shipping on ebay the main element is to decrease the price that you're going to buy the product and actually sell it at a higher margin increasing your profit margin so how do you do that it's quite simple you head over to a website called cj dropshipping.com on this website one of the major things which i love about it and it differentiates from alibaba is the fact that you can have different warehouses and actually search within warehouses which we're going to do in a second but before i do that the element that i want to talk about is the actual thing on the right side which is the shipping calculation and once we click on it it's going to open on the next window over here what we're going to do is we're going to look at the platform that we're going to use for example ebay then we're going to select from where you want the product to be shipped from now this is the main element so we're going to say that we want it to be shipped from the us and then we can add the postal code or we can even add the amount of grams so we're going to put 200 grams over here just to make sure and then we're going to say that we're shipping to the united states from the united states and all the shipping methods are going to be available now before we hit calculate we're going to select that it's going to be an ordinary product it's going to be electronic product it's going to be a magnetic product and then we're going to hit calculate so it's going to give us the price for the usp is going to be six dollars 88 the service is going to be 94 cents the total shipping is going to cost seven dollars and 82 with the delivery time is going to be 37 days now for example if we change it and we say that we're going to get it from china and then it's going to be shipped to the us we're going to hit calculate and it's going to give us the element over here of how much the product is going to cost us so let's check out what the product is going to cost us for this particular element so once we hit calculate it's going to give us the complete breakdown of what it is going to cost us to get this product one of the major things that you're going to notice is the delivery time has significantly increased now this is a problem because you want to make sure that you find the right product at the right price in and near the warehouse from where you're based for example if you're based in thailand you can always head over to warehouse in thailand if you're based in the u.s you can go to the u.s warehouse at warehouse if you're based in australia you can go to the australian warehouse and there's so many warehouses that are available there warehouses in saudi arabia in philippines in pakistan in france in the uae in new zealand poland morocco and obviously wherever is the nearest you can always head over there and get that product from that warehouse and literally what is going to happen is the fact 
fact that you'll be able to source your product at a very good price and at the same time get the product really fast now the second thing one i want to mention is the fact that you can always integrate your ebay account and how you do that it's quite simple if you don't have an ebay account you can always sign up and register to ebay and once you've done it all you need to do is click on my ebay and go to summary and once you go to summary you'll see that on the top right hand side corner over here you're going to have your ebay id which is going to be any particular personalized customized id for you now obviously from that you want to head over to your drop shipping over here and once you do that just click on your profile or click on my cj and once you do that you're going to go to your dashboard and if you haven't registered on cj drop shipping guys don't worry click in the description below on the link and register yourself right now to get the right authorization and the right place to start drop shipping by using CJ. Now, once you've done it, I want you to scroll down and click on store authorization. And obviously, as you can see, you have Shopify, you got TikTok, you got eBay, you got API. We're gonna do it for eBay. Now, I have already done it, but I'm gonna show you how you need to do it. As you can clearly see, my store is available over here. We can put a store name, it is authorized. I can connect and get all the elements from CJ drop shipping to my eBay if you don't want add another store all you need to do is click on add store and then put the store name and just click on authorize it's very simple it's very easy it's very straightforward guys it's not rocket science if you find anything difficult do ask me in the comment section below and i'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you have now once you've done it what we're going to do is we're going to head back over here and search for phone cases because we searched for phone cases on ebay we found how much the phone cases are going to be now we want to find out how how much the phone case is going to be on cj drop shipping now as you can see it is going to cost us a dollar 62 it's going to cost us a dollar 34 it's going to cost us 97 cents this seems very interesting and once we click on it we'll be able to see all the information related to this particular product and obviously one of the things i want to highlight to you guys is the fact that you can easily contact the supplier who is supplying this particular product and you can cut out the middleman you can look at the wholesale you can look at the pre-order inventory as well and you can also check from where warehouse is getting from and you can check the inventory as well for example if you put the cj inventory you can get the cj inventory and if you go for the actual factory inventory you can get the factory inventory and what more you can do is the fact that you can select the actual platform where you want it to be shipped from and how you want it to be shipped to now once you've done it you can customize it and you can share the right item over here so once we click on customize it is going to take us to the next step where every single element that we have we can customize it we can change it we can develop it the way we want and by adding a request form you can have a complete customization of this particular product and you can request this so whenever you get the product it's going to be customized to your liking and you can do that from here you can put the description the attachment the product or reference the target price and obviously your information and they will get in contact with you besides this guys the best thing is the fact that you can integrate both these elements by clicking on connect and as you click on connect you can actually get the product that is going to be established in your store with a product connection and automatic order fulfillment as well it is very simple and straightforward guys if you have any questions whatsoever do ask me in the comment section below and if you've not subscribed to the channel guys do subscribe to the channel so more people can find out how to integrate cj drop shipping with your ebay store to ensure that you can develop a successful and scalable drop shipping business in today's time and age stay tuned for our next video until then take care